This is Gene Key, KDD News. NewsChannel10.com reports a head-on collision in southwest Amarillo sends two people to the hospital with serious injuries. It happened on Hillside between Coulter and Sansi late Sunday afternoon. Authorities say a white truck was going west and a black car was going east. They are still trying to figure out what happened. Both were wearing seatbelts and they are expected to recover. While 2011 ended with moisture in one form or another making welcome appearance in Moore County over the last weeks of December, do not expect Mother Nature to wash away the impact of the drought anytime soon. The Amarillo Office of the National Weather Service reported it finished the year having received 7 inches of precipitation well under the record low of 9.56 set in 1970. By the middle of late summer, things might moderate, they're saying there are equal chances of average rainfall and that carries over to the fall. The record lack of rain was just part of the story. Further suffering came from record low temperatures in February and an all-time high temperature of 111 degrees on June 26 in the Texas Panhandle. MyHighPlains.com reports from Canyon. A third person has died from injuries in a rollover on Interstate 27 Friday. The Texas Department of Public Safety said Saturday, Abadi Omar, 26, died at Northwest Texas Hospital. He and one other person was transported to the hospital via helicopter with critical injuries Friday afternoon. A van carrying 15 people rolled more than twice after a driver swerved to avoid debris in the roadway and lost control. Twelve were thrown out of the van. The crash happened at about 2 p.m. Friday. Passengers were being driven from Amarillo to their work site in Plainview. The names of the two who died on scene Friday were released by the Department of Public Safety. They are Abderazak Mohammed, 24, and Amar Ashur. Ashur's age was not given. If you'd like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDD News.